Hey guys, long time no see. Uh, yeah, it's been uh, how many months since I last made a video? Nine, I think. Um, I'm making this video in particular for my Facebook audience since, yeah, I used to post videos on YouTube and not really mention, talk about it much on Facebook, so in a way this is kind of like a first video for me in, in some ways. Um, in other ways, it's my year and five months and uh, twenty somewhat days I've been on testosterone. Anyway, um, so as if I'm starting from scratch, just want to say hi. My name is Cyrus, and I'm a trans guy. And some of you, most of you, probably know that already. To so those of you on my um, Facebook account, um, I think majority of the people on my account know that about me. Knows that. You know, I was basically a guy born in the wrong body, um, and yeah, I I am me, and I I love I love who I am. I I love my life, really. Um, well, speaking of my life, um, part of the reason why I stopped doing videos because they just there is just so much that went on. I uh, let's see to summarize my life. The past nine months of my life, in a few seconds, um, I lost my job, was uh, unemployed for three months, found another one, um, I spent three days in jail for getting caught driving without my license, and it's a, it's this really long, ridiculous thing, it's like, because before, I got caught for DUI, right, so got my license um, revoked for that. And then I got caught driving um, without it, and it's the the punishment was worse because it was the re revocation was because of the DUI versus just driving without a license. Um, let's see. So yeah, I spent three days in uh, the women's section of of uh, local correctional facility, and yeah, it was the three most traumatic days of my life. Um, took me a long time to kind of get over the trauma of that. Let's see, what else? I'm single now. Um, not really, not really wanting to talk about that part, as it's long, drawn-out story that I could probably cover at some other time. And uh, but yeah, so just me, um, lonely. I'll be the first to admit that, but I'm, I guess, I lost, you know, I, I lost track of myself in a way, I, I didn't, I stopped going to the gym as much, um, I'm starting to go back to the gym more, um, starting to eat better, starting to, well, still got one nasty habit I need to kick, and yeah, I know it's, it's bad, but I'm working on it. Yeah, smoking is bad, and I do want to quit, but, uh, yeah, um, another talk for another time. I'm doing this video in particular because I realize that I've been in my last couple of videos I talked about how I was bombarded by people, surrounded by people, and I just wanted to be alone and isolated, and now it's been like nine months of isolation. I mean, yeah, I was hanging out with um, my friend, my ex, whatever, you know, whatever, whatever, <laughs> my friend, and her friends, and, you know, we socialize and stuff, but it wasn't the same, or it's not the same. And I know I'm cool with them. I know they're cool with me. At the same time, I I don't know. There's just there's just been well, it's not really the last. It's mostly been the last month and a half or two months. The month before that wasn't so bad, but the last couple months it's just been um, quite lonely. Uh, at my job, it's quiet. I'm on a computer doing nothing for eight to twelve hours a day. Um, 
I'm yeah I'm and if I'm not at work I'm at home behind a computer so uh yeah I, my social time has been severely almost non-existent <laughs> and so I think the the solitude is starting to weigh on me and I decided you know what I need maybe I should start doing videos again um I stopped recording myself I stopped taking pictures I, I stopped keeping track of my transition because I was kind of at odds with myself about it and not, not to mention I did I was the trauma of, from the prison stuff and then just little things that were just getting under my skin and I, I kind of wanted to just step away from the world for a little bit to focus on myself and then and I ended up being too focused on the isolation part and not really working on myself. I don't know if that makes any sense. I want to redo, I want to make do a do-over of my It Gets Better video. Um, yeah, I've just learned a lot more about myself in this past eight, nine months. I've, I learned, I know, I understand people a little better and having that dual perce perce uh, perception of you know, having been brought up female, interacting as female and all that, versus now where I am, I'm just a guy, and it's fun talking to even little things like going shopping or going going to restaurants, and people are saying, you know, have a good day, sir. Have a good night, sir. Thank you, sir. Um, how are you day? Or, you know, how your day? How is your day, sir? Or, just, or just meeting random people and just, and just being like, hey bro, what's up? It, yeah, it's, it's, it's been great as far as that goes. Um, and for the most part, the people in my life have been pretty supportive. Uh, just this past Thanksgiving, I spent some time with the um, side of my family that I don't get to see that often. And it was the first time they've seen me since my transition. And so it was awkward. It was uncomfortable. But I went through it. It was nice to, you know, see family. I, I, hold on. Sorry about that. Um, neighbor came by to check the mail. I do have to say that today is a very beautiful day, and uh, as my ROTC uh, uh, teacher in high school would say, it's a beautiful day in the land of Aloha. I mean, it is sunny. I mean, the wind is chilly because it's getting to winter. And of course, most of the people on the mainland or other parts of the world would just laugh at us because our idea of cold is like lower 70s, upper 60s, upper mid 60s. The wind has definitely gotten chilly. Definitely gotten chilly. Um, what was I talking about? Brain fart. <laughs> um, I wish I'd start planning how things I want to discuss in my videos. Um, let's see, changes, not much, oh, I went, I, I was missing a couple of my shots, I went an entire month without my shots, and that did numbers, that did numbers to my moods, um, my sex drive just plummeted down to zero, um, I think my, my facial hair just, it's growing a lot, it's growing slower, um, yeah, it's just my face, I mean, my legs are my legs are pretty hairy. Other parts of my body and all that, whatever. But yeah, my face is the slowest, and, and that's all. That's always been the case. Facial hair is always the slowest to grow, and it's not that big of a deal. Um, yeah, you know, I don't have problems passing. Um, I hardly wear a binder anymore because it's just damn uncomfortable, and I know it does damage to um, my chest tissue. I just need to save up money and get the surgery. Just done with um, so yeah uh, this is basically just my video saying I'm back I'm gotta try and be a better man every day of my life from now on um, thank you to all of you who have supported me on this journey friends and family um, I know some people it's been an adjustment trying to understand where I'm coming from and 
choices I've made, and the choice wasn't to transition more uh, as a as a choice. It was more like choosing to be happy, choosing to live my life as myself. And I, if nothing else, that's what I want people to understand about me. Um, is that I just want to live my life as myself and be loved and respected. You know, as a brother, as a friend. You know, someday a father, maybe. Who knows? Um, yeah. If so, if anyone's you know, if anyone's got questions, um, feel free to you know message me and stuff. I will try and set up. Um, I don't know, a blog or something. Um, there is my Facebook, but I try to keep that. Well, if people on YouTube, the trans people, you know, there's always free to um, message me for my Facebook stuff. Um, but yeah, I am. I'm here. I'm still around, and I hope everyone's doing well. I hope that everyone had a nice Thanksgiving. You know, have a good holiday season. And yeah, I will try to post more videos and see where that goes. Alright guys, ladies and gents, take care, and I'll catch y'all later. Aloha.